Hello, how are you? Yes, I'm very well, thank you. Very well indeed. This video is all about this hairstyle. It's a totally timeless classic and one which I've been asked for for ages. So finally, I've done it and I'm going to show you how. What we've got are really slicked back sides, combed right back with a pomade, straight against the head, and then with the top, We've got one side pushed back slightly, and then the other side builds itself up into this wave which comes over, finishing in this tiny little curl on the front. And if you look on the top, it looks almost like the hair is back, but also forward into the front. Now this centerpiece is often called an elephant's trunk because it wraps around to the front. The longer your hair is on top, the more you're gonna be able to do it. It does take some practice, it's not easy guys, I have been trying this one for a while. But watch on and let's see if you can get it. For this style you will need four things. A hairdryer, a brush, it can either be a round brush like I've got, or a flat brush. A pomade, I'm using black and white hairdressing pomade. I'm using this because it's nice and thick and it really helps to give that authentic greaser look. And finally, you'll need a comb and you'll want to keep this with you all day to keep your hair super slick and super cool. So when you're ready, let's go. Okay, so in terms of my hair length, the top has just been left long and it comes down just to the tip of my nose. With the back and sides, ideally for this hairstyle, you want to have a bit of length to play with. I've got left long and then tapered slightly shorter. What we're going to do is we're going to set the hairstyle using wet hair and a hairdryer. We're going to grab our brush and the movement for this is we're going to push it and slick back the sides, each side, and then up in the center, like so. And that's just what we're gonna be doing, each side with the hair dryer, blasting right at that. I'm gonna to continue to do this until my hair is dry, and then I'm gonna add the product and really work in that style. Medium heat, high, fast speed. Okay, when your hair has started to dry, we're going to grab our pomade. And what I'm going to do is just put a little bit on my fingers, about that much, rub it into my hands. I'm just going to push down the sides, just flattening them. From the fingers, into the heel of the hand, to the back of the head. And then with the top, we're going to do it quite similar, this time with a lot less product, into the hands. I'm going to do my left side, because my hair, you can see, is coming up, that is where that slight curl is going to be. So I'm just going to push back on the top, you can actually hold this top curl out of the way, and then a little bit more. this over. Right guys, and what I'm going to do now is to grab my comb and keep working these back bits straight back. The top, I'm going to keep working it up and over, just really working into that wave. And I'm pushing it straight to the back, and the back is just going to come in and meet the other side in the centre. Using that hand to smooth it and then taking that.
really careful guys. This is not a hairstyle if you're in a rush. It's so intricate. Okay. Right. With the back, as I say, I'm just going to tease it into the centre. If you've got a double mirror, so one on the front and one on the back, then that would really help to be able to see where you can taper it into the centre. And there we go. I am done. We've got my hair slicked back on the sides, like so. Really neat with that comb just to give it that real greaser vibe, like so. And then the back, I've just taken in neatly from the sides, pushed in. The top, we've worked it back slightly on one side, and then on the other side, we've created this wave and the tiny little curl on the front. And if you look on the top, it looks almost like the hair is back but also forward into the front. Not an easy style, but one that you definitely will get with a bit of practice. Thank you very much for watching. As ever, please do like it, hate it, just rate it, please. Make sure you've clicked that subscribe button, see all my videos as soon as they go live, and then jump on over onto my channel to see my other hair how-tos, my grooming reviews, my style hauls, tips and bits. But for now, bye-bye.